Hello my loves, welcome and welcome back to my YouTube channel. It is your girl Kinesthetic with the Kinesthetics and I'm here with you guys today with a new video. If you know me, if you know Kendra, if you know Kinesthetic, you guys know I love a pair of sunglasses so in today's video i'll be giving you guys a new in sunglasses trial haul all of these sunglasses are perfect for the spring and summer season which is upon us so if you guys are interested in seeing new sunglasses that i have added to my collection seeing how they look on getting on the tea then go ahead and keep on watching but before we get started with today's vlog make sure you guys subscribe to my youtube channel hit that red subscribe button down below we are growing and we are glowing so i would hate for you guys to miss out so make sure you turn on your bell notifications as well period give this video a big thumbs up drop a comment down below and without further ado let's go ahead and get into the video before we get started i wanted to address today's look so my hair is in these braids that go into the two buns or whatever these were done by my sister here by underscore kimmy on instagram she does natural hair too but this is just some straight backs of my natural hair to just keep me good for the next few days okay earrings are from zara they are old my cardigan is coming from tear which is a black owned brand and then i just have on this black tank top from urban outfitters so yeah that's the look we look real cute but we about to look even cuter so let's go ahead and pop these sunglasses on <laughs> so the sunglasses featured in today's video are going to be both luxury and affordable sunglasses. I do it both, okay? I go to the targets, but then I also go to the sex. That's how you gotta do it, okay? But this first pair is from Target. This is from Target's Spring Designer Collaboration. So in case you guys don't know, Target has done it. It should still be available by the time this video goes up, but Target did a collaboration with some woman-owned brands, and one of them is a black-owned brand, which is Finoel. And this brand, Finoel, is created by a woman from Grenada, so she is a Caribbean woman as well, period. But she did a collaboration with Target. Her items, they're on my wish list, but they're not on my wish list of things I'm gonna get now. They're on my wish list of things I'm gonna get when I get to a certain status of life. You know what I'm saying? Like her robes are so fine. You guys know I love a good robe, but her items can run you, they will run you <laughs> more than like $800. So she up your prices, okay? So the fact that she did this collaboration with Target, I love it because it made her items more accessible to, you know, people who don't have the coins like that. So these sunglasses had to get them like they are so fire. <sighs> like tell me these aren't gonna look fire when I'm on a beach with the tannest tan of all tans. What? Like so freaking fire. And if you guys know me, two requirements with sunglasses. They have to show my brows. And I don't like super dark lenses. Like I'm very particular about those two things when it comes to sunglasses. I need my brows to be visible and I need my eyes to be visible just a little bit. So these sunglasses are from Target as I mentioned. They are 15 bucks and they're fire. Like they feel great quality. They feel they feel good quality. They look good quality. Like I am absolutely in love. They really snapped with these glasses. And I love the color of these sunglasses because I can see myself wearing them with so many different things. You can wear this with like a neutral look. You can wear this with the look of a pop of color. You can even wear these as like everyday glasses if you want to because and next up, we going a little higher in prices, okay? These are both taken Veneta. When I tell you guys, these were on my wish list for a while. They came in blue and they came in pink. And I'm like, I don't know if I want the pink. I don't know if I want the blue. And by the time I made up my mind and decided I wanted the pink, can y'all believe they were sold out on Bottega's website? So I was like, this is a sign. This is a sign. Like, whenever God gives you signs, you just got to listen to him, okay? So I was scrolling on Saks or Fifth. In case you guys don't know, if y'all are into sunglasses too, if you're into building or initiating your sunglass collection, especially when it comes to the luxury end, go to Saks or Fifth Avenue. Go, run now to Saks or Fifth Avenue, their website or the store, because they have fire sunglasses for a super, super discounted price. But either way, we're scrolling on Saks or Fifth and found these, and I was just like, so yeah, when God give you a sign, just listen to him. Cause he was just like, ah, 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 don't spend that money yet. Cause I got something better for you. So these, are y'all ready to see these beauties? These are stunning. Like, oh, like what? 
these are so fire like these are fire like you see the Bottega detailing on the side the shape of these like everything about them is so freaking fire to me but what is even more fire what is even more fire is how much I pay for them okay so let me get y'all right now Remember, I got these from Saxo Fifth, and I told y'all y'all need to run over there right now to get you some sunglasses. So, the original price of these were was five hundred and fifty dollars, and I was okay paying that because I was just like these glasses are super fire. So, when something is fire, I'm a love, and I sleep on it, and I, I'm still thinking about it. I'm gonna spend the money, but these were five fifty, and I paid one hundred and seventy dollars for them. So basically, sixty nine percent off. Baby, if that's not a steal, I don't know what it is. So yeah, I'm gonna say it again. If you want some sunglasses, if you're into, you know, elevating your sunglass collection, go over to Saks or Fifth Avenue because they have amazing sunglasses for discounted prices. I actually have a pair in my cart right now that I'm waiting to check out on. So I'm thinking about it until Friday. And if it's still on my mind on Friday, I will pull the club. Hopefully they still there. But yeah, these are so freaking cute. Whew. Next up, we have a little ting ting, ting ting ting, ting ting, ting ting ting. <laughs> from Louis Vuitton. This is my second pair of Louis Vuitton glasses. I got a pair of Louis Vuitton sunglasses last year for my birthday actually. And when I was in South Barts, if you guys did not see my St. Barts travel vlog, go ahead and check it out. I will link it up above and down below. But when I was in St. Barts, I saw these sunglasses and I was just like, I need to get them. I need to have them. Like they have my name all over them and I would be too upset if I go back to the US and I don't have these glasses in my suitcase. So. I spent a few point on these. I did. <laughs> and I felt so guilty at the time because I was just like, I'm going to be saving money. I'm on this trip. I already spent money to be here. But these glasses, y'all going to understand why I had to make a cute little quick exception for them. So these are the glasses. Oh, they're cute on this side. But baby, the detail. Do y'all see the detail? Like, do you guys see the mini LVs all over the gold? Honey. These make me feel like I am where I'm supposed to be in life. Financially, mentally, emotionally, physically. Like, these are like my manifestation glasses. I'm going to put these on whenever I'm manifesting because, babes, when I tell y'all that these make me feel so freaking rich, so freaking everything, okay? Everything. We're naming these my manifestation glasses. They're so cute. They're definitely like, to me, I was just like, I can wear these on, you know, several occasions. I can wear these every day if I wanted to. I ain't gonna wear them every day though. But they're like a standard pair of black sunglasses, which I love about them. I love the hardware on the side. If you look at them in the front, they look real basic. But when you turn to the side, that is where all the action is occurring, okay? Once again, love sunglasses that sit low enough so you can see my brows and the lens is not too dark. With majority of black sunglasses, I feel like the lens are always super dark. So I love the opacity of these lens. They look so like. And let me tell y'all something, okay? I ain't gonna tell y'all again. I told y'all to say, ah. Y'all need to go to St. Martin's, okay? If you're shopping for luxury items, just plan a trip to St. Martin and make your way over to St. Martin's. That's what, all I'm gonna say. But if you want more details about shopping in St. Martin's, check out my St. Martin's travel blog because I also gave you guys a guide at the end telling y'all everything y'all need to know, all of the tea. So make sure y'all go back and check out that video because, babes. When I tell y'all I'm ready to go back to St. Bart's whenever I reach my savings goal. Manifestation glasses. They right here. They right here. Yeah. Next up, I got another pair of black glasses. I saw these on AliExpress and I was like, these are so cute. These are like a Rick Owen dupe. But I had to get them because they were only like $8. And these are like the perfect travel glasses to me like when i'm traveling and i'm walking through the airport i don't want anyone to like see me i just want to go to my gate go to my destination and turn up and have a good time and i feel like these glasses exude all of that energy you know what i'm saying these glasses come in different colors as well if the black is too dark for you 
there's options i'll have the link down below and the link will give you access to all of the colors but these are so freaking cute like especially with like my hair pull back it gives it gives a situation okay it gives the situation and i absolutely love these i love the shape of them like absolutely love as i mentioned these are like eight dollars off of aliexpress the rick owen shades will run you about four or five hundred dollars which i don't mind paying but i wasn't in love with the style to pay that much money so i just went ahead and got a dupe i'm wearing these to the airport i don't want to say i'll probably lose them but i'll probably just throw them in out of my bag so yeah whenever i'm traveling i, I like to wear sunglasses that i don't care tossing them around because when i'm in the airport i'm like oh, i need to see i need to find my gate <laughs> like i'm not paying attention and being careful with my glasses so i've learned that i need to just allocate whatever glasses that i don't spend much money on to, to be like airport sunglasses for me if that makes sense i used to have this well i still have them my ysl aviator sunglasses those used to be my travel glasses but i was just like they don't deserve to be treated like this they don't so yeah affordable glasses airport glasses hey <laughs> I guess as we're on this streak of black sunglasses, I will share these sunglasses that I got. I actually found these sunglasses, well, I actually found these glasses thrifting. So if you guys have been watching my content, you guys have seen these and know the story about these, but they're so like, tell me these aren't fire. Like, tell me these are not giving you Tom Ford. Tell me these are not giving you luxury. Tell me these are not giving you vintage. So I basically found these in a thrift shop in Value Village here in Houston, Texas. And when I looked up the website that's on the inside of these glasses, I found out that these are basically glasses that um, the primary or the descriptive use of these is that after you get LASIK, like these were somebody's glasses who was recovering from LASIK. And I said, oh, but these are cute. Like, these are cute. So yeah, I bought them because they were cute. Found out they were for LASIK patients or patient and they get fashion to me, so that's what, that's what it's going to be. That's what it's going to be. It's going to be fashion. So I absolutely love these. They're not the most, like, you know, durable glasses, but they get the job done, a.k.a. they're cute. <laughs> so, yeah, I picked these up. These are, like, $3 in the thrift store, so you can't really beat that, right? So we're going to lighten things up a bit, and I purchased my first pair of, like, white sunglasses. I have, like, off-white sunglasses. I have cream sunglasses. I have, like, eggshell sunglasses. But I currently don't own, I think I have one pair. But my first high-end pair of white sunglasses from Bottega Veneta. Once again, I picked these up off of Saks Off-Fifth and they are so fire. Like, I could not take these off when I was in St. Bart's. I was just like, these are so cute. They're so cute. They look so fire on my skin tone. Like. The Bottega logo on the side. Y'all see, y'all see, y'all see it. Okay, but these are super cute. I love the shape. They complement the size of my face. I feel like I have a round face. I feel like I have a round head. Maybe it's just me and my head. Maybe my, my head is really round. But either way, I feel like it's not hard, but like it's tricky with finding sunglasses that fit with my head shape. But these are so freaking fire. Once again, low enough to see my brows. Lens, opacity, check. So I absolutely love these. I have been wearing these like back to back to back. If you guys have been watching my vlogs, y'all probably saw these. But I'm here to let you guys know. These glasses, they from Bottega Veneta. I think these were also 170 bucks too. I'm not sure the regular price, but I believe they're still available on Saks off the website. So I will go ahead and link them down below if you guys are interested in getting them. I highly recommend to get these glasses. They're like staple sunglasses for vacation, staple sunglasses for like everyday wear, staple sunglasses for every melanated girl. Every melanated girl needs a pair of white sunglasses and that's on what? Period. I purchased these glasses a while ago, but I still have not worn them, but that's gonna change real soon. If you guys tuned into my Vlogmas series, you guys remember these. Y'all do, y'all do, y'all do. <laughs> These are Tom Ford glasses and let me tell y'all something. The timing of this video is perfect and that is another reason why I say always trust God's timing, okay? I've been meaning to sit here and record this video for so long, but I'm always like, I have these sunglasses on the way, I want to wait, X, Y, and Z. But I was just on Saks Off Fifth website. I'm going to show y'all the glasses first and then we're going to get into my little story time. So box, case, glasses. 
boom, boom, fire. Like, fire, fire, vintage, luxury, that girl, it girl, boss chick, period. F and F, that girl. I don't know what else, but everything we want to be. <laughs> so I got these as a Christmas gift to myself. I purchased these off of Satire and I was scrolling on Saks or Fifth yesterday and they're on Saks or Fifth for less than what I paid on Satire. So on Satire, I think I paid like 270 for these and on Saks or Fifth, they're only $170. Like, don't all go running at once because I don't know how many pairs they have left, but I'm telling y'all, you need these glasses right here they are so fire like i feel like i would like these glasses with my hair pulled back like stud earrings or no earrings at all the hoops are a little bit too much for me but these glasses are freaking like do y'all see the material like when i saw these i wasn't supposed to be shopping y'all know me i'm trying to you know get myself together but i saw these and i'm like Kendra, if you leave these on the website like what were you thinking what were you doing like what was going through your mind at the time so i had to go ahead and get them and i'm so happy that i did but i haven't worn them yet as i mentioned but that's going to change real soon so stay tuned for looks featuring these glasses but in the meantime make sure you guys go over to Saks or fifth and get your hands on these glasses right here i ain't gonna tell y'all again okay so these are all of the sunglasses that i have purchased recently absolutely in love i would have to say that my favorite pair this is always hard this is always hard this is always hard i would have to say that my favorite pair is probably these target ones <laughs> like what these the contrast the melanin and then the cream like absolutely amazing and the price point for this quality like you really can't beat it you can't so all of these sunglasses will be linked down below for your ease of reference and your ease of shopping. All of the links included down below will be affiliate links. So when you guys shop for those links, your girl makes a little coin. Just want to throw that out there. But if you guys aren't in the business of helping me fund the Casa Kinesthetic, feel free to just go ahead and search these items online on your own. But I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure you guys comment down below and let me know what your favorite pair of glasses from this trial haul was. Also, let me know if you guys plan on picking any of them up. As I mentioned, the links will be down below. Make sure you guys subscribe if you guys like content like this. If y'all want to see looks that I create with these sunglasses, I'm telling y'all right now, make sure y'all subscribe and turn on your bell notifications. I love you guys so, so much, and I will see you guys in my next video. Say what I want to hear, cause you know it's gonna get me here. Every time I say that I'm